We knew it was coming. It was reported it was coming, and it has come. Carson Wentz has signed a four-year extension with the Eagles. They announced it via their Twitter just a couple minutes ago. We don't have any uh, totals on that contract as of yet, but all of these money moves by Howie Roseman and the Eagles this offseason were all leading to this, and Carson gets paid. So a couple weeks ago in a report, it was said that he was going to get between uh, the AAV of, of Kirk Cousins and Russell Wilson. Uh, we'll see if we can get an amount by the end of this video. So this was a contract that I wanted to get done now. I, I think it's better to get Carson locked up now than wait till next season because I got this feeling that he's going to light up the NFL this year. Oh, yeah. He is motivated. Everybody's talking about how he's injury prone. Well, he's going to come out of House of Fire. I really, really believe that. It's going to look a lot like 2017, I think. But better, maybe. We'll see. He is an MVP candidate. Lewis Riddick has made that bold proclamation, and I'm all in with it. I don't know if he's going to get to 40 touchdowns because of how the offense is and how kind of slow and methodical they are, but 35-plus set a new Eagles record again. We'll see. I wonder if there's any injury incentives in this contract. I'm sure there are. Uh, I'm, I'm sure that a lot of this money that is going to be on the table, I'm sure he's going to have to earn. I'm, I'm, we'll see how much guaranteed money there is. Um, let's see. Actually, let's see if I can find anything right now. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get an AAV yet. Uh, yeah, t ten, 10 minutes ago. I mean, this contract was announced 10 minutes ago. So there we go. Okay, we got Carson Wentz speaking about his contract. Let's, uh, let's put this video on right now. explain to you how excited I am right now um, to be a part of this great city for this many more years. Uh, it means the world to me. Uh, from the moment I got drafted here, I knew this place was special. I knew they had the most passionate fans in the world for, yeah, right. in, in all of sports. Um, and I knew we had the opportunity to, to build something truly special here. And um, to be cemented here for this much longer uh, means the world to me. Uh, I want to thank uh, my good Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, first and foremost, um, for just giving me this, this opportunity and these blessings. I want to thank my wife. Uh, she's been amazing. She's been my rock. She's been my biggest supporter um, throughout all of this, my friends, my family as well. I want to thank Jeffrey Lurie, Howie Roseman, Coach Peterson, the entire organization, all of my teammates for supporting me. Um, it's going to be a fun ride. Uh, by no means is the work done. We're just getting started. This year is going to be special. And I look forward to seeing you guys uh, on Sundays at the link this fall. Thanks again. God bless. And uh, go Eagles. All right, beautiful uh, words there from Carson Wentz. The only thing, uh, hold, the, hold the phone sideways. That's all. Okay, uh, so to move on with this video, uh, I, I, you know, I kind of made all the points here. I don't, I don't think we're going to get the AAV before I get out of here. Uh, Adam Kaplan, NFL, has he got something? Uh, yeah, still nothing. Just, just the team announcing four-year extension, nothing on the amount. Uh, Adam Kaplan did tweet Eagles if they wanted could have waited four years to extend his contract this year fifth year option and two franchise tags but they chose to chose to do right by their franchise quarterback and not make him wait well I, I again I wouldn't have made him wait either because I think you could get him cheaper right now than the end of next year or the end of the season when he's going to light up the league I really believe he's going to light up the league and it's going to increase his value right now his value isn't as high as it should be because he's coming off an injury again and all the questions are surrounding him. Is he injury prone? Can he make it through an entire season? And that's the thing. So I, I'd rather get this done now. And uh, I guess I'll make another video after the, the amount is announced. So there's that. Also, uh, I also wanted to say this. Um, I, I know I haven't been making a lot of videos recently. Um, I actually was going to take this whole week off. Um, but um, actually, obviously, this, this news was uh, too important to not do anything. So. Uh, to make a long story short, I've had two kidney transplants and I just started on new medication like two weeks ago. And whenever I start new medication, my body has to get used to it, used to it. And, um, right now it's been hard to get through a day. So, you know, I, I haven't been doing videos and I'm sorry for that. I, my, my energy is just not very high at the moment. Um, so my, my, Stomach basically feels like it's on fire. I, I do feel better than I did a week ago. So 
um, the, the, the body is slowly adjusting to this medication. The, the last time I felt like this, I, I, it was, so, so the, the medication I'm taking is called Invarsis. Um, it's to, to prevent rejection of the kidneys. Um, the last medication I took that I felt like this was something called Kozar for, for my blood pressure. And I remember that, that new medication made me feel dizzy for like two, three weeks. So same thing is happening here with this medication. I've been kind of taking a break to kind of get through this because I feel like absolute dog shit. So there's the explanation as to why I really haven't been doing videos. I'm, I'm hoping next week to really get cracking again. I, I want to get the Phillies going and I want to get uh, Sixers free agency going. I, I want to uh, really start investing into the channel again, but unfortunately I just don't have any energy at the moment. And it's, and it's very really difficult for me um, to, you know, really do a video right now. As crazy as that sounds. Um, so it's, it's difficult. I just need to rest a little bit and wait for this medication to, to wait for my body to get used to this medication. And there it is. So there are some details about my life. I am kind of a miracle baby. Um, to give you a story about that, uh, <laughs> before I was born, you know, all this, all this talk about abortion right now, uh, a doctor came into the room and said to my mother, you know, they, 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 she brought up abortion because um, I only had 10% chance of making it out of the womb. 10%. I'm a 10%er. So 10% chance, I made it out. I made it out. I came out fighting like Rocky and look at me now. So God wanted me to make it for a reason. Whether or not that's to pass along all this vast eagles knowledge that I have or not, I don't, I don't know what my purpose in life is yet. But I'm kind of a miracle and I'm here. And hopefully I'll feel better by next week so I can get you guys all the videos uh, that you want. So um, that's going to be it for this one. I uh, pretty much got all the details here. So I'm out of here. Take care. Peace.